Hello again, welcome to today's attempt at a step to puzzle on Pi Day. It's March the 14th, or 314. Uh, as long as you write the date in a specific order, which, to be honest, is not the order that I would write it in, but we'll ignore that. It's definitely Pi Day today. Um, and so, of course, I'm going to be using some words connected with Pi, and we will start with Pi is why not. In fact, let's start with a ring, because pies are obviously connected with rings, specifically circles, but we'll call them rings for the purposes of that guess. Uh, let's hope I don't need a hint, and I don't, because I put it on the third guess. That's nice. Pi, of course, is an irrational number, which means it can't be uh, written as the ratio of two integers. So it can't be 6 over 2, for example, which equals 3. But pi is not exactly equal to 3, of course. Uh, 22 over 7 is a slightly better approximation, but clearly not completely the same as pi. Um, but that has given us the A and the R. So can I charm my way into anything? Well, I've got them in the right position, which is nice, but nothing else. Is there an E? There is, but it's not there. And it's not spare either. At least we've got those last three letters all correct. Could be glare. I'll try flare first. For no real reason. So that was a little bit lucky. Um, pi, of course, is a number. It's a little bit tenuous, but it's given us the ER in the correct position. So we won't argue with that. How about a chaser? Or... Or oh, it could be caller. I don't really want to try a duplicated L. I don't know if I can think of anything else that works. Oh, it's not a duplicated L, so there definitely has to be something else that works. Is it an IER? Kgia, perhaps? No! Oh, we're in a bit of a hard mode trap here. Could be a duplicated R. Carter? Oh, wow. What is this? Carver? This is very bad. What can that letter be? Carder? Carper? I don't like any of the options. Oh, Korea! That's a duplicated E. But that required a completely different pronunciation. That's why I didn't get it. That's my excuse. I don't do this for a career, you know, unless anyone wants to pay me. Um, let's finally end with circles. That's what pi is all about. And that's helped, hasn't it? C and the E in the correct position. So we'll try another ED ending, I think. How about claimed? Ooh, OK, so it's not ED or ER. So what is it going to be? That second letter could be an, a, an H. There's not a lot of things that can come after a C. The L is either there or last. Let's try channel. I channeled all my frustration at the previous one into getting that one right. So that's quite an unusual pattern. I usually do really badly on the four letter one and get better, but I got worse and worse today up until I rescued it with the last one. So 3573. It's a shame it wasn't 3.141, wasn't it? A couple of ones would have been very nice. Incredibly unlikely, of course. But we still got there with two steps left. So that's the step two puzzle. Thank you for watching. And now go and draw some circles or eat some pie. I know which one I'd prefer.